This is why Meghan Markle's first royal tour is following in the steps of Princess Diana. Meghan Markle is set to follow in the footsteps of Princess Diana and Prince Charles as she heads to Australia, Fiji, the Kingdom of Tonga and New Zealand for her first official visit since the royal couple tied the knot last month. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's royal tour falls on the occasion of the fourth Invictus Games, which will be staged in Cindy in October. Harry and Meghan will be following in the footsteps of his parents, the Prince of Wales and Diana, whose first royal tour as a married couple was also to Australia and New Zealand. BBC reporter Lucinda Adam told the Today programme, the Duke and Duchess tour will coincide with the fourth Invictus Games which will take place in Cindy in October. The newlyweds have been invited to visit Australia and New Zealand by the country's governments. While the visits to Fiji and Tonga come at the request of the Foreign and Commonwealth Office, the trip will be a rite of passage for Meghan as she gets to grips with the daily engagements of an official royal tour. The couple will follow the steps of the Prince of Wales and Diana whose first royal tour as a royal couple was also to Australia and New Zealand. During the Prince of Wales trip with Diana, the couple traveled 23,601 miles and spent 41 days overseas. In April 2014, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge went to Australia and New Zealand, and the pair were away for 18 days, covering 23,701 miles. The visit will not be Meghan's first appearance at the Invictus game. The former Suits actress, 36, and Harry, 33 confirmed their relationship at the Toronto Games in September 2017, two months before their engagement was announced. The Kensington Palace announcement comes days after the Duke and Duchess of Sussex took their places for the first time with the Queen on Buckingham Palace's balcony after trooping the colour. The Duchess and her husband enjoyed a carriage procession to the event with other members of the royal family before they all watched the spectacle from Wellington's old office.